Welcome to Reanimator Reviews. I'm Rayanne, and today I'm going to be talking about It Stains the Sands Red. It is a 2016 release. Colin Minahan is the director, and it does focus around our main character, Molly, trying to start her difficult journey to get to Mexico, either during or shortly after a zombie apocalypse. The movie starts to show its troubles when Molly and her boyfriend do get their car stuck in the sand of the Las Vegas desert, and that's where we meet the zombie that we eventually know as Smalls. Not only is Molly battling time to reach a rendezvous for the plane to get to Mexico, she is also trying to escape a rather persistent zombie, the barren desert of Las Vegas, well, also on her period. So, what did I like about this movie? I like that you do get to see Molly's personal growth in detail throughout the movie. You see how she starts out rather irresponsible and then does make big changes mentally as she comes to terms with things and realizes what she should be doing. I also really enjoyed that I'd never seen this particular concept for a zombie to follow someone before, but if you think about it, it does really make sense. No matter how much that might gross some people out, it is a good concept. Another thing I enjoyed was that, for the most part, a lot of the decisions that Molly made were common sense. They were good decisions, and it didn't have you sitting there yelling at your screen like, why would you do that? Why would you think that's a good idea? Maybe save one decision she made, one decision. When you watch the movie, you'll understand. My dislikes. To me, there almost felt like there were three sub-stories going from where she starts out, then in the desert, and then where she eventually ends up. And sometimes it didn't feel completely cohesive, so that bothered me a little bit, but I did enjoy it for what it was. And also, you know that there's a set time limit where she has to go from broken down car to meeting up to go to Mexico. Not a large time frame, and I felt it kind of dragged a little bit with this knowledge. But I did enjoy the movie. I would give it a 3 out of 5. I do recommend it, and I did find this on Shudder. So, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Please subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell for all of my content, and thank you so much. Enjoy It Stains the Sands Red.